Hi, my name is Sunday. In this video, I'll be talking about flight suspension from November 29th and how to get refund or change flight date. So, the Moroccan government, they have announced that they are putting a ban or suspension on any flights flying into Morocco. That is especially their flight, Air Maroc, Royal Air Maroc. So to those people who have bought the flight, the ticket of Air Maroc, going to Morocco and also coming out of Morocco, meaning even if it is transiting from Morocco, Royal Air Maroc may be going to other country like Nigeria and other places. They have suspended their flight. So people who have bought Air Maroc or Royal Air Maroc, according to the Moroccan government, is being suspended for two weeks from the 29th of November until the 13th of December. According to them, before they were also maybe opening from that 13th of December, they said they're going to be monitoring it in case maybe whatsoever that may then close it or ban it, continue. Then they may also extend it. Remember what Emma Rock did last time in 2020 from one suspension to the other so they will say they will open it up the other month before you know it they will also close it back again so who knows what is going to happen because of what what is the reason this new variant that is happening that started from south africa so they are closing up their borders many countries are closing up their borders they don't want it to enter inside their country so this period we have is an emergency period so in this video we're looking at those ones that have bought that ticket what can you do to get your refund or if you want to change the dates we're looking at it in this video because they're the safe they've also announced what you need to do and how to get your refund or make changes in case maybe you want to change it to january or february next year so but first before we dive deep into it please give this video a thumb up by clicking the like button and for those ones that are not subscribed to sonero tv please do subscribe and when you subscribe make sure you click the notification bell so whenever I upload any new videos or information you will know now let's get started so this is the tweet that they tweeted at on their twitter page the royal air maroc twitter page it says following the decision of the moroccan authorities royal air maroc international flights to and from morocco are cancelled in both directions either going from or coming into in both directions are cancelled from november 29 2021 at 11:59 p.m in december 13th 2021 so that is it so they have cancelled it from 29th of november to december 13th so those who have bought that ticket sorry to you wanted to go to one place or the other so sorry to you so there's another saying that he said that in any disappointment there's a blessing maybe they're canceling the flight they don't want you to go to one be locked down in africa or in wherever you are going to but those ones who want to also leave maybe they want to travel back to europe or other country pass through morocco sorry to you as well because their flight have been canceled from 29th of november to 13th of december we don't know the only measure 13th of december they might extend it again if things are still the way it is or getting worse they might also extend it again remember royal air maroc they did it before in 2020 from one extension to the other so now let's look at what you need to do in order to get your refund or make changes to maybe to your dates of flights and other things this is what they tweeted that as well. it says royal air maroc supports its customers during this period by authorizing the change and refund of tickets from and to morocco according to the following options for any tickets with initial travel date from november 30th 2021 to december 13th so any ticket that will be booked in that period from 30th of november from 30th of november to 13th of december for instance your ticket falls in further period of suspension or cancellation then those people this is what you need to do you got to listen to it it says a change without penalty fair difference may be applicable just little difference may be applicable without you using money to change it or doing anything for a new travel date until january 
31st 2022 from or to the same destination or another point in royal emarok network so that is those ones who want to change want to make changes you have rights if you know that it falls into that from that of the 29th or 30th of november to 13th of december you are supposed to fly now they have cancelled it you can make a change according to them you can make a change until january 31st you can change it in january 31st you can put it in december 30th or in december 25th or in december 28th until january 31st or even january 1st especially those that are traveling back so if you can't travel back they can later extend your travel or change your date so this is what they are saying you have right to change your date without any penalty therefore refund maybe for those people who don't want to change the dates maybe they have bought another flight ticket they just need their money but they say refund by nominative voucher not transferable and valid for 12 months from its issuance date so they are going to give you voucher not your money back but without voucher you can use it to book the another airline again not another airline the saint royal air morocco from any date it will valid for 12 months that's what they said this voucher is refundable in cash on its expiring date if not used so now what they are saying that first they are only going to issue to you or refund back to you voucher card voucher payment so with that it will valid for 12 months then after the expiry if you did not use it at all after it expired before you now demand cash that is what they are saying at the moment they are not going to give you your money your cash they are only going to give you voucher so that is it so with that for 12 months going to be with you for 12 months then if you want to book flights again the same royal in maroc you can use the voucher to rebook flights again maybe another date you can use it within that 12 months but if for instance you did not use it you don't want to travel any longer then after the voucher has expired then you cannot demand cash meaning after they don't already use your money to do business they don't get it again after 12 months one year then before they will not give you your money back that is what they are saying so it says this voucher is fundable in cash on its expiring date if not used and on request of the customer three months at the latest after it expires three months after it does he expire then three months are the later after that three months he expires become ordinary paper with that you can't make use of it and you can't get your money back if for instance you don't need that voucher you don't want to travel again with their airline then after 12 months he expire then quickly from the date it expire you have three months to quickly book or apply for refund so that they can give you cash back if you fail within that three months to ask for refund of the cards then you will not have opportunity to ask for refund of the cash again and the voucher will not be useful again in your hand so that you got to get that clear so they said the customer will have to contact his initial point of sale to request his voucher during the validity period of his ticket so as your ticket is still valid that is what they said as your ticket is still valid now maybe you are supposed to travel in that date maybe return maybe a month later within that gap quickly go and meet the agents you bought the ticket for they tell the agent that you need refund so that is what they are saying then the refund they will not issue you voucher no matter where you are whether in europe in america wherever you are they will not refund back to you the voucher the voucher will be valid from the date of issuance from the day they gave it to you will be valid for 12 months after 12 months or within that 12 months you have right to quickly use it to book again for another flight which is the same royal air maroc to book for another date of flight if you don't want to book again don't want to travel any longer maybe they say katakata on ground or they say wahala on ground that's nigeria language they say wahala on ground then you have to wait after 12 months if voucher has expired you can request for the normal cash they will not give you the normal cash within three months after it expire if after that three months you did not request for it it becomes ordinary paper in your hand without you getting anything so this is how they have analyzed it what you need to do on how to get your refund back or how to get your date changed so for those ones who have booked for royal air maroc they said they have suspended their flight and those ones who are still willing to book look at what is happening currently you have to know before you book so look at it very well before you go and book on grand so this is it they also said that this is what they said they said situation will be assessed 
on a regular basis to modify the measures in case it becomes necessary the minister specified so meaning all these dates they are just talking about from 29th to 13th of december is not going to be the final so they are going to continue assessing it maybe every week or every two two days if the situation worsen if the situation increase that suspension they are not going to release it from that 13th they might extend it again so people should be aware people should be warned this period we have a period of emergency period of uncertainty nothing is predicted so everything on predictable so that is it for you travel if you are traveling for lost you are traveling just for fun you got to know how to travel if you are traveling for essential stuff that you cannot do without that thing then you have to risk it so that is it it's always warning on all videos so thank you for watching thank you for listening please like comment and also share it to others as well and if you know you have not subscribed to sonero tv please do subscribe and when you subscribe make sure you click the notification bell so whenever i upload any new videos or information you will know thank you and god bless you bye